the great English bowler Stuart Broad considered retiring from cricket after he got dropped out of the first test against West Indies on 8 July 2020. Were there thoughts of retirement going round my head? 100%, Broad told the Daily Mail, adding being isolated in a biosecure bubble for the series made the news harder to digest. Obviously the veteran did not hide his disappointment and frustration after he was axed from the first test match. Here are some other things Stuart Broad had to say. Because I was so down. I was expecting to play, which is always a bit of a dangerous thing in sport, but I felt I deserved to play. If I had had a different conversation with the coach the day after and the coach had said you are not in our plans, well if you are not in England's plans when you are bowling as well as you can, you are pretty screwed. I can't think of many times I have been down like that. When I have been dropped before, I can go, fair. Enough, good decision, can't really argue with that. This time, when Stokes C. Ben Stokes told me I wasn't playing, I felt my body go into shakes. I could barely speak. It was a d I wasn't playing, I was staying in a single room. I didn't sleep for two days. I was nowhere. A different decision could definitely have been made with my emotions of how I was feeling. However, when Stuart Broad was selected for the second and third test against West Indies, he performed tremendously by taking 16 wickets in the two matches including taking his 500th wicket. It would have been an absolute tragedy for the cricket fans around the world and would have impacted the England cricket team harshly if this great fast English bowler decided to retire. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe, share and like this video for more amazing videos in the future. Also, stay tuned for a video about how to watch live cricket free and safely, for those of you who can't watch matches live at this point of time.